what happened here was... Um, what happened here is they broke up and you want money from him. Now, you also booked an airplane ticket for him. And I have that Just here. a second. Did you pay for that airplane ticket in points or cash? One ticket was in points. One ticket was in cash. Was his ticket in points or cash? His ticket to Florida was in points, which I had to buy more points. I didn't have enough. And his ticket coming back was in cash. And I have receipts. And what arrangement did you make, Mr. if any, okay. that I'm going to believe with him to pay for this? Okay. Um, Mr. Kate was dating our daughter. I don't start from the beginning. I'm way okay. past the end. Okay. I'm almost right. there. I'm almost there. All right. And the fairy tale is over. Okay. I'm almost there. <laughs> okay. So All far, right. you've got a couple of hundred dollars in fees. Right. For your daughter. Right. Um, and her boyfriend. The, the and you have an airplane ticket <laughs> that you secured with points and a one-way for cash for Mr. Kate. All I want to know from you now is uh -huh. what discussion did you have with him about money? Okay, he was at our house for dinner one evening, and he had been at our house several times over the summer for dinner, and we thought him to be a nice young man and very respectful to us. And I think that's important because I would not have offered to pay for the ticket that was non-refundable. Would with you the, please with the tell whole... me what conversation that you had with him okay. about paying for the ticket? I said, if I purchase these tickets for you, I will outlay the money and the money for the timeshare, the exchange. And the intent was for him to pay me back. He agreed, Just and we second. shook hands. For him to pay you back for the whole thing, for the timeshare exchange? No, half and half. We split the, the fee. Ashley paid half. She, and he paid half. It was, he was to uh, pay What I'm asking you is, your daughter is working? My daughter was not working full-time so, at the time. So what I'm asking you is whether or not she paid you back for her half. She did. When? I think it was, I'm not sure of the date, but it was um, sometime after they broke up. So it was sometime during the month of October, she paid me $104 for that timeshare fee. So she paid you $104. Mm -hmm. And what about her plane ticket? Her plane ticket, I bought her her plane ticket because I got her tickets with my points. So you got her entire ticket with points? With my points, yes. Just a second. You got her, your, mm -hmm. her entire ticket mm -hmm. with your points? Yes. And she didn't pay you back any money for that. So all your daughter paid you for was, was $104. Mm -hmm. And how much was Mr. Kate's plane ticket? His plane ticket on the way out was valid. Forget way out. Total? Way back. Total. No. The way back that you say you paid for his in cash. I paid $116.60 for his return ticket. $116.60. And, and $140 for his ticket, that was the value of it. Don't give me the value. I'm not I, interested in the value. Okay. Couldn't care less. Okay. This is whole thing was sort of nonsense to me. Did anybody use the timeshare? No. So what did you do with your daughter's miles? Did you put them back in the bank? Listen to me carefully. Yes. I do know about those things. If you yes. cancel a ticket within a certain period of time, you can rebank the miles okay. for a fee. Did you do that? with your daughter's round-trip plane ticket. Well, on, on the Southwest flight, I did. Just as... I did. Just... But on the other flight, I could not. Well, you know, so, Miss, I'm, you, you see that I'm unsympathetic with you. I'm really unsympathetic with this whole business.